Uh, this is our HE1 combo heat press machine. Uh, first, let's test this machine. First, we uh, turn on this button to start this machine. Then, we, we will set the temperature. This is the SET button. First, we press this button. P1 means the temperature. We could uh, press this up edge to increase the temperature. And we could also press this down arrow to decrease the temperature. Then we press this SET button again. Then P2 is tab. Normally we set it at 30 seconds. We could press this up arrow to increase the time. We could also press this down arrow to decrease the time. Then we uh, press this SET button again to finish the setting. Now it's 196 degree. Now that's, this is the fabric, polyester fabric. It could be 180 degree. First we press this, display this on this. This is a submission transfer paper. The picture should face down. The picture should be face down the fabric. After this, the, te the temperature reach 200 degree. Then we press this button. Then press this up arrow to come down. Once the time finish, the machine will uh, will uh, see a sound to remind you the printing is finished. Okay, we lift this and press this down arrow to finish this music. Look at this. All the color, all the color printed on this fabric. The printing is very beautiful. Look at this. Elephant is very bright and beautiful. Okay. This is the HE1 combo heat press machine. This is the plate part. Now, first we press this power button to, to set up the machine. Then we press this SET button to set up the temperature to 200 degree. We could press this up arrow to increase the temperature. We could also press this down arrow to decrease the temperature. Then we press this SET button again to set the time. Normally we use 180 seconds for the plate, for the ceramic plate. We could press this up arrow to increase the time. We could also press this down arrow to decrease the time. Now this is the plate, this is the sublimation paper. A picture face down this. This is the sublimation tape. Okay, it's finished. We display this plate here and press this down and press this down edge to set up the time countdown. The time is come down now. Once the printing finish, it will see a sound to remind you the printing is finished.
Okay, press this down arrow to finish this ring. The number is very hard, so just uh, be careful. It's very very hard. It's very beautiful. It's a peach. The printing effect is so beautiful. Okay, this is the H E one combo heat press machine. Uh, let's test this cap part. First, we turn on this button to start this machine. Then we set the temperature. I press this SET button once. P1 means the temperature. Uh, normally we use 140 degree for the cap, for the uh, stickers. We could press this up arrow to increase temperature. And we could also press this down arrow to decrease temperature. Then we press this SET button again to set the tab. Normally we uh, print use the 12 seconds. We could press this up arrow to increase the time. We could also press this down arrow to decrease the time. Now it's we uh, we press this SET button again to finish setting. Now the temperature reach 140. This is the cap and this is the sticker. Okay. First, we press this display this cap here, sticker here. Press this button and press this down arrow. The time is come down. Once the time finish, it will see a sound to remind you the printing is finished. Okay, press this down. I will finish this. Lift up. This is cool, cool ripping. So let's wait it till it's cool. Now the printing finished. Look at this. The cap is very beautiful, very smooth. Okay, thank you. Now this is the H E one combo heat press machine. Uh, this is the mark part. First, uh, we press this button, the power button, to turn on this machine. Then we press this SET button to set the temperature. P1 is 200. Normally we use 200 Celsius. We could press this up arrow to increase, increase the temperature. We could also press this down arrow to decrease the temperature. Then we press this SET button again to set the tab. P2 is the tab. Normally we use 180 seconds for the ceramic plate and ceramic mark. We could press this up arrow to increase the, the time. We could also press this down arrow to decrease the time. Then we, pr we press this SCT button to finish setting. Once the machine reached 200 degree, we could uh, uh, print this mark. Now let's see this mug. It's a coating white mug.
This is the sublimation paper. And this is the high temperature tape. Now the picture face to this mug. Use the tape to fix. So the picture won't move. We could rig, uh, we could press, we could clockwise this to increase the pressure of this mug. Now the time reach 200 degree. We place this mug inside this. The curve is very hot. We press this here. To adjust this pressure. Okay, we press this down angle to come down the top. It will come down from 180 seconds to zero. Once the printing finish, it will reassign to remind you the printing is finished. Then you can take over this mug. But be careful, the mug is very hot. Now the printing finish, we could press this down idle to finish this sum. Push back, take over this mug. Be careful, it's very hot. Very beautiful. This elephant is so bright.